You deserve to be punished. I have done nothing to justify your betrayal. Nathan. And you, Shetra Flatnos. Why are you going to leave us? Both of you are renowned warriors from prominent families. Katgat is your home. Loki persuaded us. Who, if he was honest, would not want to live among the gods? Katgat is in danger, and you thought only of yourself. And you. I have been betrayed very often in my life, but I've never got used to it. But I will allow you to go. I cannot believe she spared us. She is truly a great woman. She spared us because she is a woman. No man in her position would have done so. Are you sure? Yes. Men are impatient. They cannot wait for anything. If they have power, they need to exercise it. Otherwise, it seems to them that they have no power. But a woman must wait almost a year to give birth. Therefore, she lives life more slowly and more deeply. What sound does a sheep make? Yes. <laughs> what do you say? If the children agree, I think it is a good idea. And so do I. Mm. Mm. And since you are pregnant with our first child, maybe you should stay home as well. What did you say? I just said that since you... I heard what you said. I know where you said it. So dismissively. Oh, you poor little woman. So weak. So helpless. You are with child. We must look after you. You know, that's not what I meant. Hmm. <sighs> Let me tell you something, Uber Lothbrook. I will not be left behind. I have had enough of compromising with the men in my life. Wherever you go, I will go too. Whatever you do, I will do too. Even to the ends of the earth, even to the ends of endurance. Isn't that what love means, hmm? Isn't it? Skull. Skull. 